outdoors. Bucks, bass, and beers. 3B Outdoors premier sponsors are Spot Hog, makers of serious archery products, and W.E. McConnell and Sons, high performance builders of high performance nationwide homes. Welcome to another season of 3B Outdoors. Have we got an awesome season for you guys? On this first hunt, we're going to Illinois, where you might see this big bruiser cruising a big alfalfa field. We're hunting with Mr. Jerry Jackson of Illinois' Ohio Valley Trophy Outfitters. Then, we're going to Tennessee, opening day of turkey season, where we're going to try to do a little tomfoolery on one of those big old Tennessee gobblers. I'm Freddie Neely, and welcome to 3B Outdoors. It's late December, we got the big dog muzzleloader all stoked up, and she's shooting right on cue. Me and Dustin are headed to Illinois, to Illinois Ohio Trophy Valley Hunts. We get up there and it's, it's just exactly like we wanted. He's got some really good accommodations, good food. So me and Dustin's got a four day hunt. So we're hunting and for the first few days, we, we actually didn't see any bucks. The, the bucks was just not coming out. we might see a big wally bopper walking around out here some more so curiosity you ever heard the curiosity kill the cat well curiosity got to us we're gonna go here and see what's on this other side come on it was our last evening right at dark we look out there and we see this really big eight pointer come out. He comes out and he's about 600 yards. There's several deer over. He comes down and it's getting darker by the minute and I'm thinking, we're not gonna get a shot at this deer. Well, all of a sudden we look out to the corner and here comes three more shooters out.
Well, this one big 10 pointer comes out and this eight pointer starts down towards him. Well, after, after I look at my deer, you can see why all these deer are busted up up here in this field. This eight pointer comes down and the 10 pointer just kind of gives him one of those looks. The eight pointer turns around and walks off. Well, the 10 pointer comes into the edge of the field and it's, it's getting darker by the minute. And I'm thinking, there's no way that we're gonna get this buck. He comes out and he starts angling down the field. And we're, we're estimating this buck at about 300 yards. And this muzzleloader we're shooting is just not your average run of the mill muzzleloader. We're shooting a 45 caliber bullet at 3,200 feet per second. Scott Boger had, knows what he's doing with these muzzleloaders. Well, he zeroed this muzzleloader in for me and I shot it once to make sure that it was right on cue. And he told us, he said, out to 300 yards boys, he said, hold right on it and it's gonna do the job. Well, I have never shot a deer at that range with a rifle. So I've got a really good rest. We're in a shooting house. The one on top of the hill's bigger. Yeah, it is. This portion of 3B Outdoors brought to you by Nelson's Outfitters, Trophy Hunts in Wyoming and Montana, Sunline, Tenzing Packs and Gear, Watson's Airlock, Kistler Rods, Under Armour, Big Dog Muzzleloaders, Fraybill, Preferred Insurance Solutions, Bass Pro Shops, and Express Signs, specializing in lighting signs, vinyl graphics, and making 3B Outdoors look good. Hey, I'm Freddie Neely from 3B Outdoors. For the last seven years, I've shot a spot hog sight. It's the most durable, dependable, rugged sight that I've ever come in contact with. After several states and several critters later, I'm still greedy. So if you want to get greedy, go give Josh Johnson from Spot Hog a call. Tell him 3B Outdoor Boys sent you. Or better yet, go to spothog.com and order all their products. Hi, I'm Eddie McConnell, owner of W.E. McConnell & Son. We are a franchise builder of Nationwide Homes. We have over 35 years of experience building, over 100 house plans to choose from, where we can customize your home plan to make your dream come true. We're not only better at building homes, we're better at building homes better. Did you build my house? I built your house. You built the best house ever. It's a dust. Hunting. Fishing. It's time we settle this. Okay, let's go to Wally's. Let's go! Nathan, Wally's has everything a hunter needs. Freddie, have you seen all the fishing tackle at Wally's? I said hunting. And I said fishing. Hey guys, 
You're both right. I'm Andrew, owner of Wally Sporting Goods, a haven for all sportsmen and women. From rifles to rods and reels, Wally Sporting Goods is your locally owned outdoor connection. Hunting and fishing. You find it, baby. You find it. I told him don't. Hey, that's 250 yards with the big dog. Oh man, give me some, baby. Give me some. Give me some. Give me some. Give me some. watching these deer and watching these deer and they go across and they come back not only one shooter we have two really big shooters in this field we had three that one buck run the other one off there's a big eight up here i don't know what this one is but he's down and he's going back to tennessee with us baby Yes. Give me something here. And I told Dustin, I said, well, it's now or never. I'm going to put the crosshairs right dead center and pull the trigger. Well, I did, and that buck hits the ground like a sack of taters. So, you know, if you guys want a gun that'll reach out there and get them, especially a muzzleloader, give old Scott Boger a call. I tell you what, Dustin. Let me put in our load in. There's no ground shrinkage here. Look at this. Look at this pig. Look at that. Hey, awesome deer. Hey, buddy, what do you think? Great Thank job. you so much. Yeah, How you job. doing, man? Yeah, 
Yes, Thank you so much. Now, who's this little man? This is my youngest boy, Brandon. He wanted to come with me to help retrieve this deer. Good job, good boy, job. That's, awesome. that's a pretty good one, isn't it? That's a great, especially late season. Big dog muzzle loader. And I don't think you could have done this with a regular muzzle loader. Dropping that here? Yes, drop right here, right Long here. Shot. Long shot. <laughs> man, I'd like to thank you again yeah. for letting yeah, us awesome. come up. Jerry Jackson, he couldn't be here. Uh, we're up here at uh, Illinois Ohio Valley Trophy Outfitters with Jerry Jackson and Mr. Brad here. They've hauled us around and Brad's looked on the map figuring out he's the Johnson County guru. So uh, he's told us where to hunt. We come in here this evening and uh, the weather has changed. The front has come in and uh, man, we've seen three shooters in this field. And uh, if you guys want to come up here and do a whitetail hunt with uh, these guys will flash it up in front of the screen. Give them a call. They're, they're number one, A number one outfitters. They got an awesome lodge and uh, they've taken some big bucks. Brad Buddy, thanks again for having us up and uh, stay tuned, guys, for more 3B Outdoors. <laughs> oh, what about that? Hey, what about that? This segment of 3B Outdoors presented by Matthews. Catch us if you can. Plano. Rage Broadheads, MotorMate USA, K9 Sunglasses, Hunter Safety Systems, Lawrence HDS Gen 2 Touch, Hardcore, Waterfowl Decoys and Gear, Luminoc, and Paul Clark State Farm Insurance, 3B Outdoors Preferred Insurance Provider. I saw Brent going hunting again this morning. I thought he was building a new home. Haven't you heard? It's already built. McConnell and Son took care of everything, completely hassle-free. You know, fans, Brenda and I, we've thought about building a new home, but we're afraid it'll end up in divorce. Nah, I think you guys will do great. Just let Andy McConnell handle all the worries. I've heard him say it many a times. He aims to save marriages. W. McConnell and Sons, give him a call. ATC Cooling and Heating, your factory authorized carrier dealer. Turn to the experts specializing in geothermal heat pump systems. Take advantage of a 30% tax credit for geothermal installation and rebates up to $1,750. Winter, spring, summer, or fall, all you have to do is call the folks at ATC Cooling and Heating. When all other brands fall, carrier and ATC stand tall. Your geothermal heat pump specialist. Ford, we're having the big deal sale. This is a big deal. Every new 2013 Ford and Lincoln will have the factory invoice posted in the window. Now that is a big deal. And we have 0% financing and no payments for 90 days on most vehicles. Do I need to say it again? Hmm, yes, that is a big deal. At Ramey Ford, we do the deal. Now that's a big deal. There they are. There they are. Oh, God, something spooked them. Was that a barren ground? No, it was my stomach. I'm hungry. Well, this turkey hunting's way overrated. Let's go down Kearney's and get us some of that roasted chicken they talk about. You know what Mike says? Seven days without chicken makes one week. Let's go. Hey, let's go. I'm all for that. You want a good home-cooked meal? Come to Lynn Garden Restaurant in Kingsport. You won't be disappointed. And here's the proof. It's opening day of spring turkey season. Me and Fess has done a little bit of homework. We've went in and we've roosted these gobblers and we know exactly where they are. Well, we finally make it to the blind. We get in the blind and as daylight is cracking, these gobblers are hammering. I mean, just Right after daylight, I give them a few calls, a few tree yips, gobble, 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 gobble. I think it's a few more days before they get fired up, but we're 
down the side of the hill. And we've been doing some calling and hopefully, hopefully we can call them back through this flat. What this is, we're just in a big old oak flat. And this is a place where they like to strut. These turkeys fly down. We can see them strutting out there, and, and we're both looking at each other saying, man, this is going to happen. Because these turkeys was fired up, strutting, gobbling, and they was coming right at us. Well, we, they get kind of down to us, and the hens come into view. They're down under the hill just yelping, going crazy. The gobblers take right off to them. We got about five gobblers in this bunch, so that shows you they've not broke up yet. So... <clears throat> We heard some hens, and we jumped a few hens off a roof. So we're just we're just crossing our fingers and hoping uh, hoping something happens. So the hens take these gobblers off, and we're sitting there, and I'm calling, Fess is filming, and all of a sudden there's three gobblers just hammered right over the hill. Well, these gobblers come in, they strut, they gobble. They come in, they go over the hill, and I'm thinking, well, you know, something's not looking good for us. But uh, they go down over the hill, and I get them fired up. I do a little fighting, purring, and cutting, and they get fired up, and it's, it's on. They come across the hill strutting, and on opening day of spring gobbler season, we take a really nice bird. Awesome right there. We made a few calls and <laughs> <Give me something. laughs> we made a few calls and and uh, these birds come down. The world pieces first bird opening day. And uh, whew, give me just a minute. <laughs> we made a few calls again. And they come off this big ridge, and they stayed just out of range. As you'll see, they weren't gobbling. They didn't do anything. They got by, they got by us, and uh, they started gobbling. So they was looking for that hen, and uh, so we had a hen on the backside. So I had another hen in my my bag. I put it together right quick and just barely stuck it out the door made just one call, man, and here he come. So, the rest is history. The, the, the new creed is on the board with the rage, the Mr. Spot Hog, the first string, bow string, the down and dirty, tough man from Eddie Salter. He give it to me personally. Thanks, Eddie. And I've got my good buddy Fess with me. And, uh, I think we just pulled an opener. I'm hoping the shot looked good. So he strummed and <laughs> strutted all over this place. So give me some more fish. Thanks, buddy. Well, let's go get my bird. There he is, old buddy. There he is. 
this go here. You know, we come in here early this morning. We've been watching these turkeys for a few days. They love to strut on this big flat right here. So we got in here early, but we got right on them. They's roosted right in these trees right here, and we thought we was too tight, but uh, you know, they didn't come right off the roost to us. We kept working them. They went around the hill, and they finally, they finally come in and give us a shot. Man, did they put on a show. I'm telling you what, I don't know if I've ever seen turkeys put on a show like that, but uh, I thank the good Lord for blessing us today, and you know, all the rest of the crew's out hunting. I've not got any text yet, but uh, you know, maybe we might be the first one, so who knows? Got the brand new Matthews Creed bow. Got my buddy Fess with me. It can't don't get no better than that. Wow, what an action-packed show. This big giant up there in Illinois. We'd like to thank Mr. Jerry Jackson from Illinois Ohio Valley Trophy Outfitters for inviting us up. If you guys want a chance at a world-class whitetail, give Mr. Jerry Jackson a call. He'll take care of you, I guarantee it. We'd also like to thank Mr. Scott Boger for providing the big dog muzzleloader. And what about that hunt in Tennessee? Opening day, big gobbler strutting, gobbling. Me and Fess had to pull some tricks out of the bag to get him within bow range. Well, we're about out of time again this week, folks. By the way, stop by and give us a shout on our Facebook page or our website. We'd like to hear from you. Join us again next week where Nathan will have you somewhere on the water. I'm Freddie Neely, and thanks for watching 3B Outdoors.